Hello once again, and this is J. Ashley Spencer. Hello, J. Ashley Spencer here. J. Ashley Spencer. This is J. Ashley Spencer. J. Ashley Spencer, and oh my god! Inside this package is something, something cool. All right, let's crack it open. This is uh, Jojo Tub Tub, by the way. Or Jada Ashley Spencer with Jojo Tub Tub. Let's open this. Oh, Jesus Christ. I, I don't know where my normal knife has gone, so I'm just going to have to use this. But let's, let's open this up. This is very risky doing this one handed. There you go. Use my knee there. I've got two knees, it's all right if I cut it. Oh my god. Alright, there's probably going to be paperwork in here, yeah. I don't really see anything, I don't know. Let's chuck that down there. Let's put away this knife in case I accidentally step on it, or st step on it, sleep on it, or some crap like that, and just stab myself in the night by accident. That would be bad. Oh god, my phone has gone to 5%. Right, let's put that there. Right, what have we got in here? Well, 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 oh my god, I thought they were going to be a bit smaller, not going to lie, but gee, Zos, Christo, alright, let me put my phone on charge and I'll be back, oh my god, look how cool that looks, Jesus, they're a bit hard to get on, and once they're on, they're like on. But look at that. They're so thick as well, that's the only thing. They're quite heavy as well. So this is my, this is my like self-mock. So I wanted to make him as unique as possible. So we got this one here, which is kind of similar to the Borg's Kran, but as a mask. Uh... Some Poe in it. Uh, that. I think this was one of my favourite ones. So I might need two hands to put this on. Oh no, no, that goes on one. There's that. See, I like this, but his mask looks way too big, man. It does look sick, though. <laughs> That's the thing. That does look really cool. I think my favourite is probably this one. But that looks well cool. It looks like a cool owl. And then uh, we've also got... I thought this one looked pretty sick. I haven't actually tried it on yet. This one here. It's giving me like some Tahu Jala... Kind of clone trooper, storm trooper vibes. I don't know what else it's giving me, so but it's something else. That's what that looks like. That looks sick. That looks well sick. Oh, I don't. I don't know if I like this one even more. I feel like it's missing something off the top, but I don't know what. So like a top bit up here. Maybe like a horn. If I could add a horn onto this, that'd be sick. But yeah. God, that, that does look really cool. Wow. All right, and we'll try the last one. Let's keep that on for now. While we open the... Struggle to open the last one with one hand. All right, open the seal up. And the last one, so all the rest have just got these little... Uh, stud bits like that and his one oh, this one I mean it's got some studs but this has actually got an axle piece so this one I feel like that will look quite cool as well and I am right that does look quite cool so I was thinking if my character kind of has all these masks 
kind of thing. So he he's got the like the staff of change, which changes stuff. That's why he's able to change into the big Paraka guy. He could change into each and every one of these for certain situations. So that could be like the mask of stealth. I I don't know what that could be. Same with this. That looks stealth. That looks stealth. I feel like this looks stealth a bit more. That also looks like the actual mask of stealth. But yeah. Look how sick they are. I'm going to send these to my cousin. Really confusing. Okay. Okay. So I thought I left it a bit short uh, in the last clip. But here is um, sort of like a comparison. Between like masks sort of thing. Um, take thingies mask Let's put that there so the these aren't they're a bit bigger than his mask especially these ones especially this one this one's massive that's about the same size as Kopaka Fantoka's mask I'd say this one at the end is probably I think it's smaller than this yeah smaller than that one okay maybe a bit bigger kind of thing oh no 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 it's smaller what am i on about but um so these ones all have like the stun on the back where it's like stuff like them masks this one have an axe on the back so like i think most manufacturers they they will not not most of them a few of them either have studs or have axles so I've seen one, which oh, I have got some more. It's just like you can choose a mask with a stud or an axle. No, I went with axle. I don't know why. I, I do prefer studs, to be fair. I, I, yeah. So sometimes I prefer stud. The, these axles seem like absolutely massive. But, yeah. So there's that. So I'm going to try it on these tower. Obviously, we've got like a Tahu, but with a spear, because I lost the other side to his staff and then he's just got this hand um a metro build kind of thing made out of another mock that i got going on and then my own um thingy mock see this is a proper size um thing so that's like the average size for a man and that's how tall i am off it hang on so the first one that I've tried was this mask on the matter torso. Honestly, it doesn't look too bad. I think it looks better than um, it does on the like Metro style. It's got that very matter matter look. I suppose the Krana were made in the matter area, so yeah. We'll go with this one. I only think they're quite stiff to put on, but yeah, once again, that actually looks pretty cool. It's a nice fit. Uh, we'll go for this one next. I don't know if this will go on. Okay, so that, that doesn't look as cool. I think this head will go, or this mask will go more with like a Nika build, which I believe I don't really have any at the moment. And I'm pretty sure this mask... Yep, yeah, it just doesn't fit on this this body, uh, th this head. So yeah, so let's chuck him away. Sorry, I'm doing this one-handed, but I can't be bothered to set up my tripod. Right, so this is really stiff to fit on, but that's what he looks like on a metro body. That's what this looks like on a metro body. Bit better, to be fair. Still think a uh, Anika will look better. That's what this looks like on a, a Metro body. I don't think it looks as good as the the Matter, to be fair. So we can make our own custom Matter team, to be fair. I don't know why I keep saying to be fair. And same with this one. I feel like this is just more of a Matter mask. Like a, especially a Nuva matter one because that that looks exactly the same. Like compare it to this, which looks more 
This looks more like that. And this one is more Fantokery Anika. But yeah. So if we so we had this one on. We've had that one on. Did we put the we did put these on, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, we did. Right, so on my actual self mark, so we've already had this one on, so we won't put that on. Put that one on. It looks a bit better because it's a like a bigger build. Because this mask looks absolutely massive. Go with this one. I don't think this looks too bad, but yeah, no, it looks all right. And then we'll finish it up with this one here. I think that looks pretty cool as well. But yeah. Anyway, um, these masks, oh god, I think they're about £10 a mask. So, 10 or under. I say 12 or under for the masks. And then you got a smoother variant, which is clear, I'm pretty sure. Which are about twenty pound, and the smoothest are thirty pound, and I got three smooth ones coming. And because I'm in the UK, uh, I think Shape Rays is an American company or something. I don't know how it works. It's come to um, quite a lot of money. So yeah, so I'd appreciate it if I get a like on this or whatever. Um, I'm gonna po post these on my Instagram as well. Hopefully, uh, that is um, Brutaka Ernak at Brutaka Ernak. I'm pretty sure. It'll be in the description of JoJo Tub Tub. But yeah, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, share, check out my videos, and goodbye, my friends. Bye.